Hello beach bums, welcome back to the beach. Today I'm hanging out with Brian. He was the winner of the Wharf's Pepsi Ultimate Summer Giveaway that we advertised for uh, several weeks. But he's the winner. Yeah. Pretty stoked, huh? It's awesome. Yeah, I mean, you get a place to stay at the wharf, you're getting to see Keith Urban, you get to fish with me. Fishing they, with the beach bum. They give you all kinds of free stuff, yeah. like gift certificates to all these places to eat, fun stuff. So pretty cool little prize package that uh, he took advantage of. So I am sorry to everyone else. You did lose. Brian is the winner. He is actually, uh, you've never been surf fishing, never. correct? Never. So I like those kind of people when I when I was running charters because that makes my job a little easier because yeah. expectations can be a little bit lower, you know? we. <laughs> Everything's kind of new for you. So hopefully we'll get into some cool fish today. Maybe some first for Brian, maybe some new PBs, but let's get to fishing. Uh, I'm guessing this is the fish gum. I see some shrimp there. Yes. When I'm set rig fishing, that's mostly what I'm using. I'll use sand fleas some too, which I've got my sand flea rig. Right. I've got one of the bearded Brad Pompano rigs here. And we're just using little pieces of shrimp and fish gum on our double drop rig. And then I've got just little pieces of shrimp that I'm putting on my other rigs, but Real simple, just kind of the standard setup today. Yeah, go ahead and start reeling. I don't know if it's still there. Go ahead and reel. Yeah, just reel. Oh, oh there. Oh, yeah. Is it there still? No, I just came off. Yeah, just keep it tight. Try to keep up. I think it was a uh, ladyfish. Yeah. I saw it jump in and going nuts. He sure laid the rod over. <laughs> Yeah, keep reeling. There he is. There he is. There he is. Yeah, just keep it tight. Looks like we got a ladyfish. He's jumping like crazy again. Did you, did you see him jumping? No. He might have spit it. It's okay. Just keep reeling. Oh, well, yeah, he's swimming. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Little lady. They, uh, they're really good at getting off because they jump so much. Oh, he's a pretty big one. Nice. You ever caught a ladyfish? Never. That's my first. Oh one. yeah. Okay. I mean, they're they're obviously not typically the target species, right? right. But uh, they're they're fun fish to catch. Got a lot of these guys around. We broke the skunk anyway. Got the skunk out. Yeah, we just tossed him back. Look at that one! My goodness! That's a new PB. That's a giant. That is a big one. Yeah, I just threw a bait close to try to get some whiting. And yeah, I'll get it. Yeah. Out there. Let's see. Well, this is uh, this is one of the northern kingfish. Right. You know, we got three of them. So you see all those little lines on them, and everything. They're pretty cool looking yep. whiting, but he's uh, he's he's a baby. We won't, we won't take a picture of that one. <laughs> we'll get a bigger one. Hey, new PB that, That's right. Uh, you, so you never caught a whiting? Never caught a whiting. Okay. Oh, there you go, there you go. Yep, he's there. There you go. All right. Got some fight to him. Hadn't jumped yet. Maybe something other than a ladyfish. Oh yeah. All that dang grass too yeah. is so annoying. Pull up real down technique. That yeah, that's just really what need that right now. Yeah, that's just like if you're fighting like a big fish. Yeah. Uh, you know, gaining ground. Anything you know, the smaller. You're just trying to keep up with them. Trying to keep the tension on the line. Little blue fish. Right. He cut my uh, weight off. These guys have have teeth on them L yeah. little tiny blue fish do you want to get a little picture of this little guy have you caught blue fish before well, blue fish. well we're knocking off some species anyway uh, they do have teeth so don't you know don't put your hand anywhere close to his gotcha. mouth just kind of hold right there right. got something look at those teeth yeah yeah, yeah. 
and get him back. Little guy. There you go. Yep. A little bit, little bigger. Maybe a little bit. Uh, upgrade your PB whiting here. <laughs> he's a little, he's a little feistier. Yeah. Right. Little, there we go, there we go. Looks like something tried to eat him. Okay. Yeah, yeah. he's got a nice gash in him. Ouch. Yeah, this is a, this is the Gulf Kingfish. So the other one, you, you know, you remember it's got all those the markings on it. There. This one's got the black tail. Okay. Uh, so this is that's two of the three species, species. of whiting, right. but uh, this is the most common one that we catch out here is the the Gulf. New PB. We're we're just constantly pr breaking PBs today. This time of year, if there's a lot like in the spring, it's a it's a lot more because there's less stuff out here. Like you're not dealing with grass, you don't have ladyfish, you don't have you're not really fishing for whiting. You can if you want, but most of the time you're just throwing out baits for pompano. And you're waiting for those schools of pompano to come by. So I mean, you'll you'll sit there for 45 minutes to an hour with just like nothing, just chilling. And then when those fish start feeding, then you're starting to get more active. But this time of year, there's just a lot more stuff. There he is. Ah, oh. he hit it pretty good. Oh, yeah. it's still on there. Yeah, he's still there. I think. Got a little shake. Yep, yep, there he is. <laughs> 11 seconds. 11 seconds. Uh, you know, whiting fishing can be a lot of fun because some, I mean, that's how it can be, but you know, sometimes if you're catching those 12 to 15 inches, yep. dude, it is a blast. It is so much fun because I mean, they hammer it and you know, you get a lot of good eating and oh, we just got the babies in here today. Still got him? Still got him. Looks like it. I don't know, it might be a ladyfish. I haven't seen a jump though, so that's a good sign. Maybe it's a pompano, that'd be sweet. He's darting around like a pompano. Just keep that pressure on him. Just trying to get this line out of your way here, just so he didn't cross us. It's a pump! All right. That's a pump! There you go! Heck yeah! That's All awesome, right. man! Thank you, thank you. That is so cool. He's, he's keeper too, All if right. you want him, we can keep him. I'll clean him up for you. We'll get some cool pictures. That's awesome, Brian! Beautiful. Hey, let's go show him to the camera over here. First ever Pompano. Brian just popped his first Pompano, and it's a keeper at that here in the summertime. I have not seen a keeper Pompano in a minute you know not right. that i've done a ton of pompano fishing here recently but uh it's good to see man any month of the year here in alabama you can still catch pompano you have eaten yes. it just never caught it never caught it awesome store-bought pompano uh, well this will be way better all right because you caught it yes <laughs> i didn't expect we'd get a pompano today honestly i okay. wasn't really hopeful on that they can be caught in the summer but it's just not common especially when you're fighting grass and you know having to work around that crap there you go. Yeah, go ahead and reel it in. He might be there. Maybe it's a giant. <laughs> He's angry at us anyway. It's another uh, gulf. That's the, only the second gulf one, but it's another tiny one. Uh, northern. Northern. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we've caught most of the ones we've been catching have been northerns. This is the only other, the only the second gulf we've caught. Yeah. That other one was the one that looked like someone to try to eat him. It's gonna be a monster, I know it. Look at him. All right. <laughs> yeah, when I was guiding, some of my best trips were when we get, oh, there you go, there you go. There's a fish on that one, go ahead. Doubling up, basically. You still feel a fish? I still feel it, I think, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's a little shake. All right, yeah, just keep it tight. Oh, la lady fish. A 
little guys. See how much darker he looks? Yeah. You notice? Yeah. Some of the best bait you can get though for redfish, sharks, bluefish, really anything. The wind has picked up and it's made it a little more difficult to get a good cast, you know? Thank you so much for watching today's video. It took me back to my guiding days, which there are a lot of fun things about guiding. There's, there's a lot of not fun things about guiding, but it was an enjoyable to experience that again. Thank you everybody that entered for the giveaway. Appreciate you supporting everything. And thank you to The Wharf and Pepsi for sponsoring the event. Got to go see Keith Urban. That was the first time I ever saw him. He was pretty pretty stellar in concert. Enjoyed that a lot. Had a good time with the wife and uh, some friends at that concert. But if you enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Would really appreciate that. And as always, you stay.